Good day and welcome to the channel. In this very short video, we're going to show you how to clear the cache partition on a Samsung Galaxy device. Uh, really, it's going to be the same on most of the Android, uh, most of the Samsung Android devices. So if you have an A series or you have a Samsung Galaxy S21 to S22, S23, S24, blah, 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 it's the same process. Now, uh, just 10 seconds before we get to that, why would you want to clear the cache partition? Well, if your phone's running sluggishly or they're having uh, weird problems with it, uh, what you want to do is dump the temporary files that are on this cache partition. So in case you're not familiar with what cache means, that's it's not C-A-S-H, it's C-A-C-H-E, cache. So it's just a store of files. And uh, uh, when you think, well, I don't want to dump all my history or whatever, yeah, you're not going to do that. It's completely safe to delete your temporary files uh, in the cache. Now, that being said, officially, this is all on your own. If you have any problems, you're on your own. But practically speaking, I've never seen it. I've done it hundreds of times. I don't think you're going to have a problem. The first thing you want to do is power down your device. In our case, we have a Samsung Galaxy S22, as you can see here. So you simply hold the power button on the side until it comes up, and we're going to select power off. So now that we have our Samsung Galaxy powered down, all we have to do is get into the uh, recovery screen, which is easy to do. Simply hold the volume up button and the power button. Hold them down together, and you will get into the special menu known as the recovery screen. So let's do that. That's the power button combined with the volume button. I'll do the volume button first, then the power, and you'll know when to release it because it will vibrate. There it is, just vibrated. I'm going to let go. There we go. Isn't that nice? Now we can move through here, not by touch, which is our usual. What we have to do is use the buttons on the side. So the volume up is go up. The volume down is go down, as you can see. And the power button is the same as enter on a keyboard. And what we're looking for is wipe cache partition. We don't want to wipe data factory reset. That would be a bad thing. We simply want to wipe the cache partition. So then you click on it with the power button. It says, are you sure you want to do that? Press the down arrow to yes. And yep. Bingo. That's about it. Just click reboot system now. Now you can see I booted up the phone and geez, it looks pretty much the same. I still have my apps. Yep, it's not wiped out. Did the app still work? Well, let's go look at my car. Bingo. Yep, still works. Charging right now. Isn't that nice? Let's go look at my photographs. Make sure that they're still there. They're still there. And my favorites. They're still there as well. So hey, if you found this video useful, please give us the big thumbs up and subscribes also always appreciated. If you have any questions or concerns, you can get a hold of us directly at www.urtech.ca. That's www.urtech.ca. Or you can leave a question or a comment below. And if we don't get back to you, somebody else will because on YouTube, everybody's got an opinion. Thanks and have a great one. Bye-bye.